The Costin Horseshoe has been specially designed to be easy to fit without even needing an anvil. All you need is hoof cutters, pull off, nail pullers, shoeing hammer, clinchers, rasp, buff, buff hammer, shoeing knife, apron, half round resecting nippers, nails and a marker pen. First, always make sure you dress the hoof before you start chewing. The shoe has got five clips. The two rear clips are fitting clips to hold the shoe in position while shoeing and are then cut off after shoeing. The three other clips are the toe clip and two quarter clips. So first you need to decide whether you want to cut off the toe clip or the two quarter clips. It's easier to shoe if you don't leave all the clips on and Steve recommends you cut off the toe clip and leave in place the two quarter clips but some farriers might prefer to leave the toe clip on and cut off the two quarter clips while others might prefer to cut off all the clips. To fit the shoe, turn it upside down and place it on the hoof. Mark the hoof where the two quarter clips should be placed. Resect where the two quarter clips will be on the hoof so that the clips fit flush with the wall of the hoof. Turn the shoe over and slide it onto the hoof until the clips fit into their resected holes. Pull the hoof out towards the front of the horse or place the hoof on the ground. See how the shoe slides back easily into the resected clip holes. Mark any excess shoe around the heels with a white marker pen. Take the shoe off and cut those parts off. After you have cut the shoe, dress it up to remove any sharp ends. Now the shoe is ready to be fitted. Slide the shoe back on and nail it on, making sure you keep the nails up high rather than low. Steve likes to use three nail holes each side of the shoe towards the toe and complete it as a normal shoeing. And that's it. Watch our online video to see Steve fitting the Costin horseshoe himself. If you have any questions, we're available to answer them. Contact details are on our website. Costin Horseshoes, groundbreaking, redefined.